I'm here with Vernon Wells of the Toronto Blue Jays, and Vernon, four home runs, you're batting 600. Is this the kind of start you wanted to get off to this year? Uh, it's better than not getting hits, but um, obviously I don't think I'm going to keep this pace up, but it's, it's fun while you're in it and just hope it lasts as long as possible. So I take it your wrist is healthy, so talk about your wrist and what you've been working on with uh, Dwayne Murphy. Uh, the wrist is good. Um, I think it's just allowing me to take more swings, and try to try to work out the, the bad habits I formed last year. And Murph and I have worked really well together, and he's he's able to tell me stuff, and uh, most of the time I'm able to listen uh, when my attention deficit's not kicking in. But um, we worked well together so far. Alex Anthopoulos takes over this ball club. He declares that this is a, a rebuilding phase for the Toronto Blue Jays. How is it for you on this uh, on this team, being a veteran here? Um, it's it's a unique experience for me, just being the uh, being the old guy on the team now. So uh, it's just a matter of uh, leading by example play the game the right way and uh, guys feed off that and we're moving in one direction and that's that's trying to rebuild this organization to get to where it needs to be to be competitive in this division. Well, speaking of some of the young kids, talk about uh, Ricky Romero and Travis Snyder and just what you've seen from those guys. Well, I think the talent there is is, uh, is amazing. I think Ricky um, is going to end up being one of the best lefties in our division, which is saying a lot with the names that are in it. So um, He's got the stuff to be dominant every time he's on the mound and I think he learned a lot uh, being around Doc last year and what it takes to be consistent at this level, especially uh, playing against the teams that we play against. And I heard you're making a difference in some unfortunate children's lives. Talk about your Perfect 10 Foundation and how much that means to you in Texas. Well, I think that's the most important thing that goes on in my life. Um, I'm in a position to, to impact so many lives and uh, that's why I'm on this earth. I mean, uh, I get to play a game for a living and I get to, uh, to hopefully reach as many people as possible. And, uh, if you can change lives, that's that's what this that's what this world's all about. Well, good luck this season. Thank you.